Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 video. In this video, I would like to cover another reward that we get from Season 5, and that would be the uh, Cardinal Bird Cage. I do apologize if I mispronounced that. Uh, but anyway, so the only way to obtain this specific bird so far, we don't know what's going to happen in the future, is by playing Season 5, reaching rank 15, and having a Fallout First subscription. So let's not waste time and jump right into the video. Alright, so let's begin the review of the item. Now, the first thing what you should know, this thing is automatically uh, animated, so this is what they do all the time. And they make sound. <laughs> so cute. Uh, the other thing is, it's limited to three, so you can't build more than three. Alright, uh, it's located in the floor decor section. If you scroll the way through all of your lists, you will essentially end up finding the birdcage. Right? There's only one version of it, and that's how it is. All right? Now, as I've mentioned, this thing is uh, locked behind a Fallout First subscription. And man, I, when I was making a review of the DLC and everything, I did mention that, man, uh, Bethesda is really pushing it with this season. They actually placed... I didn't expect this to be so good, to be honest, the birdcage. But it turns out it was actually really nice very well detailed and as I said it's only available if you are a follow first subscribe subscriber and if you played season 5 and if you've reached uh, rank 15 so there we go the other thing is man another good what is hidden behind uh, follow first subscription is the Brotherhood of Steel kit which I'm gonna review once I'll get to it like I said that man this should have been somewhere over here well, don't get me wrong, Fallout First uh, members also should get some exclusive stuff, so uh, you know what, I kind of think, okay, fine, bird, okay, but something like this crazy, this should be uh, like over there, kind of like, you know, that's how it is. Anyway, so the bird is cool, I'm actually very well surprised, I didn't expect this item to be so cool, <laughs> what can I say, it's cute, <laughs> self-animated, it just I'm hoping man that we're gonna get some more of this stuff. Maybe build a freaking Fallout 76 zoo <laughs> with real live animals and stuff like that. That would just walk around, make some noise, you know, that'll be cool. So Bethesda, take notes. <laughs> Bethesda spies. So yeah, that's how it is. The item is nice and yeah. Well, you know what? I would recommend actually maybe trying to get a follow first uh, subscription just for season 5 and I would most probably recommend doing so during the double XP event so when do we have a double XP I think next month I, I, I don't remember uh, the thing is whatever you claim during having the subscription active you can still use it so like for example as an example uh, if you have uh, claimed this outfit right here from Fallout First, right? This one right here. You can only claim this. Uh, these were limited. All of this, what you're seeing, all of them are were limited for amount of time. So I don't know when they return. But this thing is uh, within the membership. So for example, you claim it, right? You get the outfit, you get the helmet, this one right here, because they all part like a part. And uh, once you end your subscription, you still have access to build it like and use it so I would assume that uh, the building things like this thing is gonna be available so when your subscription ends it should be available but and I'm, and I'm like 99.99% sure that it, it is gonna be available the only thing what's not gonna be available for example as an example is that if you have for example claimed um, the fallout tents right I mean these tents skins these will not be available because you will not be able to use the tent once your membership ends but everything else should be available to you 
and yeah, so you can claim it for a month, uh, get a good reward for the atoms and other benefits, and just cancel it. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Alright, Z-Clan, this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video. By the way, I have noticed something. If you build just one cage, it, they don't kind of like talk. It, all it does is it feels lonely it's just there without no talks but down in the shelter we had three of them and they were actually making that noise so I just noticed that I have that also in mind but yeah this is where we're gonna be calling it the end for this video so I hope you enjoyed it and if you did you know the drill don't forget to hit that like comment down below please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube nobody see them nobody can read them nobody can respond to them so if you got something to say positive negative feel free to comment the only thing I ask of you is not to swear simple as that and if you're new and you subscribe well welcome to z clan i'm gamer z soul from ukraine so hi from ukraine once again thanks all for watching if you want to join our discord feel free to do so the link is down in the video description we're over 800 members over there so make sure to read our rules because if you break our rules essentially you will get banned by me or by my mods and it's a perma ban just to make it clear perfectly clear no turning back and uh, since the Discord is huge, you have the ability to uh, control on what chats you want to see. So for example, if you want to see just Fallout 76 chats, you click Fallout 76 and you'll see only Fallout 76 chats. We have other chats such as trade chats, but they're linked to additional uh, rules, so you'll need to confirm the rules again. And uh, you'll be able to see the trade chats and the social uh, chats such as food fights, travels, and stuff like that. Recommend the movie, recommend music. So basically like social activity stuff. Uh, and we do have other games and spoiler chats. Once again, all you got to do is just select the correct user role and you'll see all the new chats. So the link uh, to the Discord, you'll find it down in the video description if you want to stop by any of my live streams, which I don't have at the moment a fixed schedule. I try to stream when I can and I do that on Twitch. You are free to follow me on Twitch as well. So once again, thanks all for watching. Y'all have a good morning, day and night, whatever you guys located at. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future.